Hello everybody, this is X Dr. Mario Master X here. Welcome to my Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. So in the last episode, we actually explored the Great Sea. Got most of the map filled in. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven squares to fill fill this place. So So we got a we got a new, well, we got a piece of heart, or two pieces of heart, as a matter of fact. Let me look. Yep. And we killed some enemies on the platform. Now, we're going to explore more of the Great Sea. Okay, come on, Link. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, don't sink. So what island do we need to explore next? So, I am going to set the wind to south. I think we ought to do that. This is going to be one long, another long video. Uh, it, it is what it is. So, let's see. Oh, wait a minute, you know what? Hold up now. What kind of moon do we have out here tonight? Oh, it's just that. Well, I did take a picture of the full moon in one of my previous videos. So... Yeah, it's actually 10.37 a.m. Just to let you guys know. You know. It'd be funny if Great Fish Isle was, uh... Storming and had a ghost ship here. So... Let's lure in some more bait, shall we? Man, this island just got destroyed. Destroyed by Nightmare Spinning Blade. What are you making BattleBots references for? Alright, alright. Um. There's a lot of treasure I can get. So, what do we have here? Boy, small fry! Let's open up that sea chart, buddy! Here we go again. The Great Fish Isle. You should come around these parts on nights when just a wee bit on the left half of the moon is missing. That's when it appears, Fly. That's all the info I've got that's all the info I've got to offer. Can't speak this morning. And with that, I'm off. Man, I was just holding my uh microphone like a like a heavy metal singer here. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. I want to go east here. There's another island we can get to. Oh, I mean, I mean west. Okay, dude, that is the second time you've done that. I'm not looking down on the controller. Man, I need to stop getting east and west mixed together. I'm getting confused about that, though. I gotta stop doing that, man. Getting east and west together. What is this, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Master Quest? Well, even though I am gonna do that game in the future. Oh, 
Holy moly. So anyway, it is 10.40 a.m. So how is everybody doing today? So I know we've got a winter storm warning. And the only thing you got to worry about aside from the snow is the ice. You have to be very wary of the ice. It's the only thing you got to worry about. Alright. What do you have here? We got a fish. We got a fish man here. It's freedom. Very. No, it's fish. Hi, small fry. Let's open up that Z chart, buddy. It's freedom. Now, come on. Let's get out of here before somebody sees us. Okay, it's freedom. And it's fish. I met a I met a really weird guy on the island due east of here. He had a pack on his back huger than any pack that I've seen ever seen. I mean it was B I G fry big. He said he was looking for treasure. But what does he expect to find in a place like that? I tell you, the guy is completely obsessed. And that's all the info I've got to offer. And with that, I am off. There goes the fish, man. You know, that's the three eye reef. Oh, yeah, don't you be throwing your bombs at me. Who do you think you are? So, let's uh, set the wind to south. Set it to the south, my friend. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Actually, maybe I did. Oh, the echoes. The wind is set into the southeast. There's Needle Rock Isle again. So, yeah, we're not gonna... We're not gonna do that dungeon anytime soon, because we do not have a specific weapon. Or, or a specific upgrade to that, you know? Oh, these warships here? You can actually get a Triforce chart early, early on if you want. See that, see that warship right there that looks like a, looks like a Spartan. I call it the Spartan's warship. Uh, I'm not, I'm not gonna do it. There's another island east of here. Oh, the, yeah, that's right. It's the Isla of Steel. Oh, well, well, well. What do we have here? Do my eyes deceive me? I see a treasure, and I'm gonna get it. Oh, don't do that. Sorry, Link. That was my bad. My fault, Link. So, what do we have here? That'd be fake. That'd be funny if this was a fake Octorok chest. That'd been so funny. So, what do we have here? What do we got? Come to Mama. We got a silver rupee. It's time to jump for joy. Got that right. Anyway, we need to we need to give uh, the fishman some bait. What are you doing? What are you doing there? He's in the spoils bag. You crazy? Oh, here we go. Boy, small fry. Let's open up that sea chart. 
And I know Brian's getting sick and tired of this, but he's not. Here it is, Needle Rock Isle. You've seen the boats sailing around here with the real huge cannons, right, Fry? I bet you those things have their holes packed through it treasure. Of course, if you don't have a cannon yourself, there's no way you'll ever sink one of them. And that's all the info I've got to offer, and with that, I'm off. Oh, I'm just gonna switch my weapons just in case. Switch my items. Okay, I'm gonna set the wind to east. Somebody... Is the phone ringing over there? I'm gonna go check in a minute. Anyway... So there's the Islet of Steel. There's an enemy platform over there, and to tell you the truth, don't even bother going there. You're gonna regret it if you do. Trust me on this one. Trust me. Yeah, that one right there. Cause they have got whiz robes there, and you don't wanna you don't wanna go there, trust me. Those whiz robes will mess you up because you do not have a specific weapon to uh, defeat them yet. I mean, you could defeat them with the hook shot, which I did in the randomizer. It works just as well, but I'll just be on the safe side. But just to be on the safe side, I'm not going to go over there. Don't even bother. There's another Triforce chart here, if you want to get it. But, I'm not gonna get it yet. Not yet. Oh, you know what? Pretty soon I might do the Dark Linka edition of, uh, of this game in the R Wind Waker randomizer. It's crazy, though. That game looks... That version of that game, the randomizer looks, well... Interesting. Creepy. I'm not scared of that, you know. Boy, small fry! Open up that sea chart, my friend! We got the Islet of Steel! Tell me, small fry, have you ever heard of the fabled set of tri Triumph books? Well, it's right here, my young fry. On that island, you know, a chart showing you where to find them. Of course, getting it is the hard part. And that's all the info I've got to offer. And with that, I'm off. Okay, we need to set the wind to southwest. So, I think we ought to do that. We've actually filled in the entire map. Literally. We have filled in almost the entire map of the Great Sea. They talk about being an open world game here, huh? Because you can actually do anything you want on this game, like Breath of the Wild. I know Breath of the Wild's uh, video game map is huge. Actually, 12 times bigger than Twilight Princess. I would give that game a perfect 10 out of 10 because I've actually beaten it. Beaten the game, you know? It's actually amazing. You know, we got a purple rupee. That's just great. check okay all right what I'm wanting to do 
I'm not going to that platform over there. Nope. So, what I'm wanting to do, I want to actually, uh, avoid the 12 eyed Octorok for now. Just to let you know, because I don't want to face it yet. I don't want to do it. How many bombs do we have? 79. Yeah, I just wasted all those bombs trying to blow up the cannons on the boat, you know. Speaking of boats, you know that Mastodon album? You know, man, I cannot speak this morning. Tr man, trust me, I just cannot speak this morning. I'm not tired or anything, I just might need to eat my lunch. Anyway, about Mastodon, the heavy metal band. You know that the Mastodon album Leviathan? That is such an awesome album. Trust me. I just love that album. Especially Remission and Mastodon's later albums. Including uh, Blood Mountain, Crack the Sky, The Hunter, and what else? Once More Around the Sun. I actually love that album too. And Emperor of Sand. I haven't uh, listened to Code Dark Place and Medium Rarities yet. Especially Hushed and Grim. Really? We haven't gotten this yet? Alright. I have listened to the Call of the Mastodon. And that's an awesome EP album, you know. Oh my god. Man, I haven't uh hang on a minute. Uh I'm just gonna go slow here. Nice and slow, man. Nice and slow. Oh man, look at that. Uh, the ghost ship might appear. Let's throw in some more bait. We can't do anything here at the Diamond Steep Island, just to let you know. Boy, small fry. Let's open up that sea chart for you, my friend. So what do we have here? Diamond Steep Island, as usual. Oh, I've got some great information, small fry. Lucky you. If you use the treasure that's hidden on that island there, a thing that vanishes as soon as you get near it. It won't vanish anymore. You know it. I'm talking about it. That thing that appears on night when a wee bit of the right half of the moon is missing. Don't you know what I'm talking about? It. And that's all I've got to offer. And with that, I'm off. Yep, believe it or not, he is actually talking about the ghost ship. We're not going to do that anytime soon. Okay, I want to avoid this 12-eyed Octorok if I can. Um, let's see. Put, on, put the grappling hook back on. There we go, that's better. So, yeah, we actually have three bottles, and... Yeah, we're good. Oh, you know what? Okay, it's storming. That's not good. Man, is it always got a storm? Well, it's not raining and storming in real life. It's just, uh... It's just, you know. 
know, it's just sunny outside right now. And here's the thing, though. Here's the thing, though. That storm is gonna come by. Oh man, look at these guys. Look at these guys. See the sea hats there? So, what do we got here? Boy, small fry. Let's open up that sea chart. Possibly for the final time. Go ahead. We got Horseshoe Island. On the island due east of here lives an old man who was once a master swordsman. He's got proof of it too. He has a knight's crest. Want to know about? Want to know what that thing is, Fly? Well, too bad I can't go giving it away every secret, and that's all the info I've got to offer. With that, I'm off. Uh oh. Okay. All right. I want to get my grappling hook back on. All right. We're gonna set the wind to east. We're going east, not west. East. Hey, I I didn't get east and west mixed together this time. Oh, don't you? Yeah, don't even think about it, Sea Hat. You and your spiky ass chin. Get out of here. Why don't you be uh, trying to trying to ram me off with your spiky ass chin? Yeah, get out of here. With, get out of here with your spiky ass chin. Oh, another one, huh? Who do you think you are? Those fish off the Three Stooges? When, uh... Mo Howard goes fishing on that episode, you know? When he actually catched a really big fish. He... He was apparently... Apparently... What a big fish. On that episode, though... The same episode... Curly Howard actually went underwater. And he actually shot five of those fish. I mean, you know, it's actually good to have, have brothers. You know, like going fishing. Because I actually went fishing one time. Well, actually, I did go fishing at Camp Freedom, but I didn't catch any fish. And that was okay, though. Yeah, that was okay, though, because... You can't catch all the fish, you know. I did actually went to Camp Freedom about, what, two or three times. I absolutely had fun there. I believe it was actually summer camp. And it was. Uh, we got some more treasure here. I'll just pick these up for fun. Maybe we can call it a video here on Outset Island. I don't know though. Do I want to do that? And we got a purple rupee. What a purple nurple. You know. What? Purple nurple? Anyway. Man. I know in the Dark Linka edition of this game, you know, in the randomizer, there are new maps and stuff. And I mean, it's crazy. I mean, they have giant Stalfos. And the characters actually look different. I think. Oh, I don't have any more. Can't carry any more. Oh. Anyway. Yep. I know in the Dark Linka edition, the enemies that change up, and. Well. 
And it does. So, where do I want to go here? I'm thinking about going to that submarine that I missed. I could have done this earlier, but nah. But nah, it is what it is. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Where's Southern Fairy Island again? Oh, it's over there. Well, let me change the wind direction. Man, I should have kept the uh, wind direction at the east. Should have kept it at east, you know. What island? Oh yeah, that's Headstone Island. Okay. Shark Island. I'm not gonna do that anytime soon. You know. Anyway, it is actually 11.01 a.m. Seriously, it is actually 11.01 a.m. It's 11 o'clock. More like 11 o'clock. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Yeah, there's a submarine right there. There you go, there's the submarine. It's right there. But we are going to be doing that next time, you guys. We're going to do that next time. Hate to say it, but it's true. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before we go, before I end... Alright, before I end this video, let's get the treasure chest here. Oh, let's get that treasure chest, shall we? Oh, let's do this. It's probably gonna be another 20 or 50 rupees. I just like to get these for fun. You know. 11.02 a.m. It is actually February 1st of uh, 2022. Believe it or not, my birthday is actually in... Um, 17 days, so I'm probably going to be uh, 31, and I never lie about my age, you know. Jesus, look at my magic meter. It's actually pretty low. Not lying. Alrighty. Next time on The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker, we are going to go inside the submarine. So we'll, we'll be doing that. See you next time, you guys. Goodbye.